Nouveau. I'm Brian Goulet of the Goulet Pen Company and Ape Nouveau. Uh, what I'm going to show you here today is how to have a really fast and easy way to flush out your cartridge converter fountain pen. It's much, much easier than the old way to do it. Um, it's using an ear bulb syringe, and I'll show you exactly how that works. The um, traditional way of flushing out a cartridge converter fountain pen is to, when your pen runs out of ink, you take it apart and you essentially dip it into water and then you pull you pull the uh, syringe up through and then you flush it out and then you pull it up and flush it out and pull it up and flush it out and you end up doing that probably 20 or 30 times to get it completely clean. Well I want to show you a shortcut of how to do it. You take the uh, converter off so that you have just the pen part and then you're, what you're going to do is you're going to use something here called an ear bulb syringe which is this. It's uh, commonly known as a boogie sucker if you have a baby. Um, they have them at hospitals, but you can get them at uh, any drugstore will have these things. They're called ear, ear syringes or something like that. It might run you five bucks, but it's going to save you a ton of work, and I'll show you how. Take the syringe and you press it like that. You have one container with water and one without. You can do it at your sink with a bowl of water, whatever you want to do. So you take this, you draw it up. It's going to suck up a bunch of water. And then you take the bulb, you put it onto the back of your fountain pen, and then you just push the ink through. And you can see how dark that ink is um, because it's, there's a lot of ink that's going in there um, that's getting flushed out. But as you feed more and more water through, you can see how it's running clear. Well, what you've done is you've just taken about 20 cartridge converter uh, screw ups and screw downs to try to flush out your pen. And that's what you end up with is a nice clean pen. Now you still might have a little bit on the nib so you can take and just kind of dip that in the water and get that out. But you can see I even still have water left in there. There you go. And then this thing is completely clean. And then you can either just take a napkin or a paper towel and uh, kind of hold it on the nib and that's going to draw all the remaining moisture that's in your feed and that's going to draw it all out and dry it out so that if you want to switch colors um, you don't end up with a bunch of water and you can see how the water that's drawing out has, has no color to it at all. So that thing is completely clean. And that took me, what, 20 seconds or something with my instructions talking? And then you have a little bit of water here in the back so all you have to do is kind of stick a paper towel in there and dry it out. And then this sucker is ready to have a new ink. And then when your cartridge converter, um, it's got some ink in it so all you do with this you push out all the excess that you have here of the ink, you draw it up, draw it back out, but you have a lot less ink stored in this thing than you would have in the feed, so you're only going to flush it a couple of times to get it all out. And I'm going to show you another little trick here as you're doing it. Um, you, when you have these, nib, uh, these cartridge converters, um, the converter tends to like to kind of store the ink up right here towards the tip. And uh, you can flush and fill it all day long, but if you just take it and you can see right there, see how it kind of stores it right there? Fill it partially and make sure it has a little bit of air in it and give it a little bit of a shake. Look at that, look how dark that water just turned right now. Give it a little bit of a shake, push it back out. Fill it again, push it out. You might have to do that a couple of times depending on the kind of ink that you're using to get it completely clean. This is the hardest part of cleaning the cartridge converter, as you can see. But uh, black is one of the hardest colors to clear out because it's so dark. There you go. Shake it out, get the excess, and then you're ready to go to clean your new pen and get your new color. That's about it. So get yourself an ear bulb syringe filler if you. Uh, if you have a cartridge converter fountain pen because it'll save you a lot of time and it'll save you a lot of effort. So thanks a lot for sticking with me. I appreciate it. Uh, let me know what you think. Email me at brianagoulepens.com and let me know what you think of my uh, little tip here. And If you have any other ones, let me know and I'll share it with the world. Thanks a lot and I'll see you again next time on Ink Nouveau.